Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today is quite a random vlog because I just thought, why not vlog today? I'm actually going um, Christmas shopping with Vicky. If you've been here a while, you know, she's my best friend. I always go shopping with her <laughs> and um, I'm just about to do my eyelashes. So I just thought I'd show you quickly sort of what I use to do them because I know how much eyelashes are now to get done professionally. And honestly, you don't need to. There's a, just a few little products you need and you can do them yourself. They Mine last about a week, depending. I'm rough with mine as well. I'm very rough with mine, the way I sleep and things. You may notice on some of my vlogs are all a bit twisted and things. But if you look after them, they would last a long time. And obviously they take me, well, you'll see how long it takes me. <coughs> but let me show you a few things, right? Today I've got... What have you even done with the box? I don't even know what I've done with the box to show you. Oh my God, what is wrong with me? They're these um, Allure ones and I just get the, I get any ones actually, whichever's cheap. I go into Savers and get like 2 99 ones and things. So it's whatever works for you really, whichever, how big you want them and things like that. But the glue is the most important thing. So I know a lot of people try them and say, oh, they come off, oh, it doesn't work, but it's the glue, it's the glue that you need. Now, I get my glue off um, a lady here on YouTube, she's called um, Juliet Dudley. Um, and if you type in Google, um, Glow Up Beauty by Juliet Dudley and it'll come up. And I get, she does like sets with her lashes. I'm not keen on her lashes, but the glues are amazing. They, her lashes might be brilliant for you, but they're just not for me. Um, I get the lash adhesive. And what you do is, let me turn you around. I'll show you each product. Yeah, it's like a, a little black mascara brush. Like that, it's tiny, tiny. And you need the tiniest little bit. One of these will last you a good year. So you're only, and they're only like seven quid. So it's not as if you've got a, now, where's, how's the best way to do this so you can see? I don't know. I don't know how to do this because if I put you here, I won't be able to do them myself. Mm, let me, no, I'll do you this way because it's not exactly like it's rocket science. It's quite easy. So all you do is paint it on. Like so, like it's mascara. You don't need loads. You certainly do not need loads. So, let's paint. I mean, my eyelashes are absolutely awful. And if you do it this way, they don't wreck your own eyelashes. Well, I never found it. Anyway, I've been wearing them for years and my eyelashes are the same as they always was. So yeah, just like that. Only a little bit. Look at my, my natural eyelashes are absolutely awful. I wasn't blessed with nice eyelashes. My kids are. And now you wait for them to dry. Now what I do is I get the strip lashes like I've just said. And what I do is I cut them up into little sections like that. Yeah, so I cut them up into four or five pieces. Like I say, it's whatever works for you, but that's what I do. I prefer them big, they're easier to put on. And this is the other thing I get from her. This is, I don't know what this is called, but you can see on the pictures that, you know, there's not that many of them. So this is all she does, the black and the white. And the white actually go on the eyelash and then you stick them underneath. And you use this glue, you'll never go back, believe me. And this lasts, it doesn't last as long as the black stuff, but it lasts a good six months. So literally, like what you spend on, like, what, what must they be now? I don't know, I haven't had mine done for a while, but it was I was paying like 50 quid a time and it was just, it was unsustainable, you know? So I found this, I mean, it might take you a few tries to get it, because it did me. But once you've got it, you can do it so quickly. So the glue's starting to get a bit tacky now, so... I do one on this side and one on this side, one on this side, one on this side, so it gives it time to dry. So I get the end piece like that. And then it comes like a little brush like that and you just paint it on. Just on the, obviously the base, don't go right down to the ends, just where your eyelashes are gonna be. And you don't, like again, you don't need loads. So as you can see, I've painted it on and it goes Wait till it goes like a little bit tacky. And then I just, oh God, it always sticks to my bottom lashes though. And I just literally place it on 
but sometimes my tweezers, like they are now, get sticky. And that's it. Do the same with this side. Now, the end one. You just keep building it up like that, but it's so easy, honestly. It takes no time at all. Rather than sitting there for two hours getting your eyelashes done, right? Anyway, I thought I'd hop on as well and say thank you for all your comments about like that you like to see like a bit of um, realism in vlogs and things. I love that because if you're like me, like, and you watch a lot of the YouTube ladies, I mean, they're lovely and they've got it down to a fine art. They really have because they've been doing it so long, but they're like got perfect houses. Uh, they looked, per they look perfect. They've got like everything, their perfect life. You know, they look like they have a perfect life. Whereas I think personally, my life is perfect to me. Like I have my health. I have uh, a lovely husband. I have two beautiful children that have all got their health. I have my lovely animals. I have a roof over my head. I don't have to work because I'm lucky enough that my husband, you know, earns enough. I'm I am so lucky in so many ways. And I class that as the perfect life for me. But I'm not perfect. My life isn't perfect. Nobody's life is perfect. So when you are looking at these people, their life isn't really like that. Everybody knows this, right? It, it's, it's not. So please don't ever, like, what I want to say is please don't ever compare yourself and think, oh, I wish my life was like that. Why isn't my life like that? Why isn't my home like that? Why isn't this like that? Because theirs isn't really, you know, it's just, you know, it's just all for, for show, really. But I'm so pleased that you like, like my content, that it's a bit more real. And it always will be. So stick around if you're watching this for the first time. And it always will be like that. Because that's the life I lead. I'm just a normal person, you know, trying to get along just like everybody else is. So I'm so grateful for that comments because it really does cheer me up that you like. I think everyone gets a bit sick of seeing it, all the perfect life. It gets a bit depressing as well, right? Because when I watch these vlogs and they've got like these halls of such lovely stuff, I'm like, oh God, I can't afford that. And I want it and it depresses me. So hopefully I've cheered you up a little bit. <laughs> So, yeah, as you can see, this isn't taking very long uh, at all. So what I'll do is I'll put you on time lapse while I finish it. Lights out, hearts beating faster in a minute. I'm high on slow dancing with you. One, two, three, keep it going, last forever All blacked out, then flying with you I don't care that my... Okay, so I've put them all on Just got to wait for them to dry a little bit And then I'll sort of stick them on more And I'm not going to put any makeup on today I'm just literally going to put some of this lipstick on Now someone asked me in a few videos ago What lipstick I was wearing And it's actually this one Superstay 24 hour colour and it's in oh my god my eyes plum plum seduction so yeah i got this one from savers they're not that expensive and you put this one on first and it does last it's really good very good so there we go and then we wait for that to dry and then put the other one on and that's literally the only makeup i'm gonna wear today because i can't be bothered and I'm only going shopping, so, like I say, not a perfect life. <laughs> I wish I had time to sit here and do a full face of makeup and things. But my skin goes so dry if I stick loads of foundation on and things. It's awful. I'd love a really expensive cream to sort of sort it out. Anyway, so I just gone tacky now and then you just use this bit. So, for the lady that was asking, that's it. It's number 240. And it is a nice colour, actually, but you get loads of different colours. But I love the Maybelline Superstay ones. They're really good. In fact, they're the only ones I wear. Right, now, these should be dry enough. So I, all I do is get the tweezers now and just separate, obviously, because it's sticking to the bottom. Again, it doesn't do this all the whole time. You got them on, by the way. So I'll pull them apart. That's it. And now I just push them from underneath onto the my lashes. 
my own eyelashes. So all I do is just push them gently with the edge of the tweezers. Now this side, I put a bit too much glue on this one. But how long did that take me? What, like five minutes, literally? And they will last about a week. And honestly, I absolutely love them. But like I say, it's all in the glue. You get crappy glue, they're not going to last and they're not going to stick properly. And they'll be so much more fiddly. And honestly, just go onto her website, Glow Up Beauty, Juliet Dudley. And every time, honestly, spend about 20 quid and that's you for about a year. Because like I say, you can get your lashes from anywhere. I do. The cheaper, the better, really. So there, there we go. All done. Any um, thing you've missed, just message me and I can do you another in-depth one, but I just thought it's, there's not much to it. <laughs> Literally, there's nothing to it. So if I can do it, believe me, you can. Anyway, I'm going to go and get in the car now and go and pick Vicky up and let's go and do some Christmas shopping. I'm so excited. <laughs> Okay, we've just finished lunch. We had like a donna kebab thing. Oh, it was lovely and it was quite reasonable actually. It's like a new place. Um, and we've just been in Claire's and had a little look for some Christmas presents. And we're just going in this new Cards Direct shop. Because what do you want, Vic? Um, birthday cards. Birthday cards. Oh yeah, because it's her son's birthday. So she's looking in here for that birthday right before Christmas. Could you only imagine what that would be like? So she struggles a bit with that. But yeah, and then we're gonna go in the B&M, so I'll show you what's new in there when we go in.
Okay, so that's us finished. Uh, um, oh my God, my honestly has gone a bit funny. Um, that's us finished now. We got um, a few bits. I'll show you what I got when I got home, but mainly it was Christmas presents. And now I'm all depressed of how much money I've spent because it was obviously, but you have to get it, otherwise, you know. Um, so now we're on our way to Starbucks because uh, Vic says they've got the new Christmas cake pops out. So we're just gonna get them for the girls um, before I go and pick them up. And um, I don't know what uh, Christmas drinks they've got, but I'll uh, have a look at what um, Christmas drinks they've got as well, see if I uh, might treat myself. So I'll show you when we get it. Right, I've just dropped Vicky off. She was a bit shy today because she said, she looked like rubbish, so she didn't want to be on camera. I said, nobody cares. <laughs> but she's not like, obviously, I am. Because at the start, um, if you ever watch any of my very, very early vlogs, because uh, I've only been doing it, like, not even a year. So, like, I just, I was so embarrassed in front of the camera. I didn't know what to say, which is so strange because I'm not a shy person at all. I could go into a crowded room and just start talking to anybody. I am not shy, never have been. But it's weird, like, talking to a phone. But now I know that I'm speaking to you guys. It's, a, it's, it's different. It's like I am actually talking to you. So I find it quite natural now. But obviously, my friends don't. So... Anyway, I've dropped her off. We went to Starbucks. Oh, they never had, they don't do Christmas cake pops. God knows where Vicky got that from. I think it's only in America. Uh, but I did get Maria a chocolate cake pop. They've only just started to get cake pops in in um, Starbucks, but Maria like, really likes them. Maya doesn't, but I got Maria a chocolate one. And they never had any eggnog syrup. It's literally their first day, more or less, of doing them, and they haven't got any of the eggnog syrup. Oh, I'm so annoyed. I love the eggnog, but I got a gingerbread latte with gingerbread cream on top, and oh my god, it's so nice. Mmm. I'm definitely glad I went with it. Actually, it tastes really Christmassy. So I am sort of in the Christmas spirit after going. Oh my god, I spent so much money today. Oh, it's so everything has gone up like even like the christmas presents and things things that like little gift sets oh sorry little gift sets and things that were like 3.99 for example last year are now 5.99 this year and it's it's really making a difference to um to my spending anyway um but i i have got quite a bit for the girls now but it's just everybody else that i need to get for like mark and my parents and my brother and things like that so oh i don't know and it's still paying all the bills and oh, it's I, oh, I don't know you'll have to let me know how you're doing it because a lot of people i oh, can't believe how much people are struggling now i feel so so sorry for people that just literally can't afford to eat let alone get their kids a christmas present and it makes me so sad to think that that's going on that in in our day and age that it's like that and we're talking about people that work hard as well it's just it's so sad i i really feel for some people i mean at least i can get my kids christmas presents and things but i don't know it, it's awful it's it's such a pressure and when you see on the telly like um these christmas adverts and they're all sat at like a perfect christmas table with all this lovely food and everything looks gorgeous all the decorations and things and it puts pressure on people to want to sort of make it like that for your family and it's awful when you can't and you know, that's my little rant anyway i'm just wanted to say how much things have gone up but I'm, I'm just pretty sure that everybody is aware but i've got some lovely bits for the kids i won't be able to show you the things i got for the kids because obviously the kids watch my videos so but i i got a few other bits that i'll show you when i get home so i'm just on my way to get the kids now and then when i get home i'll um show you i just got pizza for time it seems like every time i do a vlog i'm doing pizza honestly we don't have it all the time we literally hardly ever have it but every time i seem to vlog we're having it but we don't have it all the time but yes, yeah, so I'm going to go and, and um, get the kids, go home, and I'll show you what I've got from the shops. Okay, I'm back now. Um, sorry about the funny angle. You're on my little tripod. I can't be bothered to go upstairs and get my big one. So, um, I get little sparkles here. Yes. Just had to go to the vet and get their flea stuff. But it's 26 quid for the two of them. Yes. Yes. Anyway, let me show you what I got. Obviously, I can't show you the stuff for Christmas because the girl, like I said, the girls watch it. But what I did get... I got these from B&M, two pound. Because Mark takes a takeaway coffee to work in the morning. It's like in a metal cup, but I thought that'd be so cute over Christmas. 
How nice are they? Two pound for eight. So that's a nice little treat for him. Uh, cat food. This is the only one Binks will have. Literally. He's so fussy. So that's that. I got this from TK Maxx. It was 4 .99. It's a Zara tinted moisturiser. I don't know about the colour, but I'm just hoping that this is my colour. For a fiver, I thought, from Zara. Oh, I don't know. It looks a bit dark. Yeah, I don't know. But, oh well. Yeah. If not, my mum's quite dark. I could maybe give it to her. Um, so I got that. Mark's been moaning about his back really, really hurting um, this morning. So I got him some um, aspirin. And I got this. This was in pounds. Pounds, Trisha? Pounds savers. Savers. It was in savers. Um, look, it's like a hot water bottle and you can tie it around yourself so you can just walk around with it. So I thought that'd be perfect. You can put it on his back and just you don't need to worry about it. Or you can have it on your tummy if you've got like period pains or whatever. Yeah, that was a tenner. So I thought that's that's really good. So I got that for him. Oh, these are the eyelashes I've actually got on today. So I bought some more for next week. They're those ones. They're like 3 99 I think. So, but I really like those ones. Toothpaste. I got this from B&M. Now I know obviously Halloween's gone, but all the Halloween stuff was in the sale. And this was down from five pound to two pound 50. And I had my eye on this for ages. So I thought, sod it. I'm just going to get it for next year. So yeah, I got that. So if you've got a and m and you've got fancy some Halloween stuff, get down there because everything's half price. It's really good. Uh, what else did I get? I got this. £1.49. Look, I thought I'd feel in the Christmas spirit because I'm going to wear that Christmas day. <laughs> but I thought £1.49 was quite good because they're quite expensive in like Claire's and things. I got this from Tesco. Look at that. Uh, it's... um bath and shower gel it's a little festive one it smells oh so good it smells like it's coconutty but it smells like bacon if i like when you bake that's what it smells like oh it's lovely uh i also got this i treated myself from tk max i had all the like ray dunn stuff in i think i filmed them actually White Christmas, and it's massive, so that'd be perfect in the morning for my big coffee, look, Ray Dunn. And it was 5 99 so I love that. I absolutely love that. So I got that for me, for a little treat. It's if I haven't got enough mugs. Me and mugs, honestly, I'm terrible. And the last thing I got was from b and It's this, sorry, it's 15 pound, but I thought I'd put that on my sofa now and um, have it all over Christmas, because it is Christmassy, but it's also like nice and normal. It's got like the fluffy bit on that side and it's so soft. Look what it says. Heat yourself, not your home. <laughs> so I thought that's quite good. And that's what made me buy it, really. So, yeah, I got that as well. So that's all I got. Um, obviously, I did get, like I say, Christmas stuff. Um, but that's all I got that I can show you. So it's... Um, I love that hot water bottle thing. So I'm going to pack all this away. I'm going to make the kids one of these each. Because Maya's actually got a hair appointment just like a cut and blow dry at quarter past five i've managed to fit her in so um i'm gonna get sorted here now before i uh take her to that and just make that so i'll catch up with you in a minute okay this is where we're going to get maya's hair done she's gonna get layers and a trim around the face so let's go in okay so that's the back before and then i'll show you after and we're back now and that is the after it looks amazing maya do you want to show me your bangs look at that it is lovely so yeah so now i'm just going to put the pizza in and i am so tired now but it's like six o'clock or something so yeah i better get dinner on Look at, how, oh, and Sweepy's just dove on it. Look at how nice that looks on the sofa. And please look, look. I've literally just put it on and look. Oh, my God. You've got to laugh. That looks lovely, I think, on the sofa. A little bit of Christmas without going too mad. Literally, the lady opposite me has put her Christmas tree up. I don't think so. I need a bit of calm in the house before I put the tree up, I think. But I used to put it there. But now I, there's no space. So I'm thinking I'm going to put it there. So uh, hopefully it fits. I've never put it there before, but yeah, we'll wait and see. So 
yeah, I'm just going to light the candles now and um, settle in for the night, I think. Okay, so that's me chilling out now. It's about half six. Mark's still not back from work, bless him. So I'll have to do our pizzas and things when he comes home. The girls are in now. And I'm so pleased it's Friday and I can just have a lie in tomorrow. I'm really tired tonight. I'm really tired. Look at Sweepy on my new blanket. Honestly, I know I can't have anything, nothing sacred in my house. But Maya's hair looks lovely. I also booked myself in. Normally my friend does it, but um, I just wanted to get it like washed nice and all that sort of thing. Whereas when it's in our house, I, I, I sort of don't get that. But she's brilliant, but I just thought, oh, I'd try it. And it's the same price. So what I'm going to get is I'm going to get a full head of highlights and a root smudge. I don't know if any of you have ever heard of it, but it's like... It stops the roots being so like, pew. and I've noticed today, you can't see in this light or this camera, but I've got loads of grey hairs in my roots. So I'm like, oh no. So, yeah, so I'm getting it done, not next week, the week after. Um, so I can't wait for that. That'll be so nice. But yeah, I'm, um, yeah, look at, look, I mean, look at the roots. Honestly, it makes you feel better once you've had it done as well, doesn't it? So I'm going to have to find the money for that now as well. So that Christmas presents everything oh god i'm sure you lot can relate but if any of you guys have ever had like a root smudge please tell me if you liked it and like if you think i should get it or not you don't recommend it or what whatever please do let me know because i'd be very interested and yes yeah, so i'm just going to chill out now but thank you so much for spending the day with me and coming along on our little um shopping trip and i am um, no before you go Subscribe if you haven't and give me a big thumbs up and I'll see everyone in my next video. Bye everyone.